to this day. 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 What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counterpunch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Deontay, the Bronze Bomber Wilder, Anthony Joshua, and Eddie Hearn. Get this. Deontay Wilder agrees to an outstanding deal for the Middle East. Heavyweight force Deontay Wilder will fight in the Middle East this year after agreeing to a deal with the Saudi Arabian investors. Now, that's according to Eddie Hearn, the promoter, hoping to add his fighter, Anthony Joshua, into the mix. Hearn is looking to secure a similar deal to Wilder for AJ so that the pair can trade blows for the end of the year. And this is what Eddie said. He said, it's Saudi dealing directly with Deontay Wilder and me, Hearn told Pro Box TV. So not me trying to do a deal with Wilder. I don't know where they're up to with that, but I would think they may have that deal done. They don't have our deal done, he added, okay? He said he's been out there, Wilder. They've been talking all the time. He's never had a massive payday like AJ has. They know what AJ made to fight Andy Ruiz and to fight Alexander Usyk and Saudi, so they know the levels that we need to talk about if they want it to happen. I think it'll happen, okay? Um, and those are the words of Eddie Hearn and Let Me Counterpunch. Uh, I think at this point, there is no reason why these, this fight can't happen. This is no longer a deal about pride, about networks, about this, about that, about any of it. Okay, um, the zone has attempted to reel Wilder in, but it was for a massive or multi fight deal, which Wilder and his handlers weren't weren't uh, willing to do. Okay, they weren't with it, and they didn't like the idea of the zone having that control. You know, I know Al Heyman wouldn't like that. You know, I don't know how Shelly Finkel would feel. I think they feel the same way as Al Heyman. But in this case, you know, the Saudis have the money. You know, people know where the money is. People seen where the money is. So that's where people go, where the money is. So um, I like the idea that Wilder doesn't have to deal with Eddie Hearn necessarily because of the history between the two and the two camps with Shelly Finkel and Eddie Hearn and their differences and all that. But I think Deontay Wilder should jump on this opportunity. And I think there's a reason for rhyme. I think there's a reason why Deontay Wilder didn't want that Andy Ruiz fight. Why? Because he's accustomed to fighting in these type of situations where he fights, puts his life on the line, and don't really get the pay that he deserves on time. Bars. And we've seen in an interview that he was sick of it. You know, and he said, well, hey, we're going to go elsewhere and we're going to look elsewhere. And then I think this is elsewhere. Where else could it be? The UK, the zone, matchroom. You know, no, the Saudis have the most money. They have the most money when it's dealing with this on this magnitude. The zone is probably second. But I guarantee you that's why Andy Ruiz and Deontay Wilder are not mixing it up in the ring simply because there's not enough money to do that. There's no guarantee. And with any fighter that puts his life on the line, the, the first thing you should offer him is a guarantee, at least is a guarantee of something, some type of amount to secure some type of purse. I don't care where you get it from, give it to me. I'm the fighter, I'm the talent, I'm the performer, give me the money. So um, with Wilder agreeing, it just makes this easier, okay? You know, but this is boxing, the sport that I love, that I hate so much, but you know, you'd think the person that you would have the most problems it with 
you know, <laughs> won't be. It'll be something totally different than what we imagined. But it is good to hear that Deontay Wilder has agreed, you know, however, Eddie Hearn is, this is an assumption, okay? We got to keep it a buck because he doesn't know what the Saudis uh, have talked to Wilder about or what Wilder has agreed about, okay? So that's just something that he's assuming, you know, that that deal is done unless he heard it from the grapevine and I haven't heard from this article that he's heard it from the grapevine. But anyway, you guys tell me what you think of Eddie Hearn uh, claiming that Deontay Wilder has agreed to his portion of this Saudi Arabia super fight tournament deal for multi-millions of dollars. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunched. Peace.